One of the other issues that we commonly see with TWS is a, there's a phase issue with one of the channels. And what basically will happen is uh, the device will connect. Everything will seem like it's working. Uh, one channel will con consistently play music and the second channel will just kind of cut in and out as though it's not receiving the full signal. And the reason that happens is because your signal comes from device to one earbud and then passes to the second earbud, uh, passes through to the second earbud. Now the second earbud, if it's not getting that signal correctly, it needs to be reset. So the very first thing you do is you remove it from your device um, completely. So to remove a Bluetooth device, um, it's pretty simple. Uh, you go to your list and in my phone, you'll see a lot of Bluetooth devices. So we're gonna just, uh, I've already removed this device uh, from my list, but just to show you what that looks like on an Android, uh, you simply go to the uh, settings and you're gonna unpair it. So now it's not in my list of devices, of paired devices, and you can see that uh, obviously because those are my paired devices. So um, again, if my Bluetooth is off, obviously I don't see any list of devices. If it's on, um, I'll see the, <clears throat> the common list of devices. now. The thing is, is uh, these headphones right here, um, we've completely removed all devices um, that they've been connected to. So right now that you can see that they're just charging, I'm gonna pick them up and do the same reset uh, technique that we did on our other um, pairing. And so we're just gonna put our ear up to it. And you're gonna hear a power on signal. Now we're gonna do it again. And we have a power off. now. Now that they're power off again, um, you see that they're both charging again. So I went in and powered on, powered off while in there. So I did a hold for power on, hold for power off. Now they're completely separated from each other. So the very first thing we do before we connect them to our device is we want them to connect to each other. So we're gonna pick them up again. And by doing so, so we're here uh, connected. And so now what you see again is you see that we have a fast blinking uh, alternating red and blue, which means this is going to be our master unit. It's always the right unit, and that's going to connect to our device. And you have a slow blinking blue, which means that it's been connected. You also got a verbal confirmation that they were connected. So this is now the slave to the master. And so now we're going to go ahead and turn on our Bluetooth, and you're going to see this happen pretty quickly. So you see the N80, N80, oops, you see the N81s. So we're going to go ahead and connect, pair them. Pairing request, pairing successful. Now they're connected. Now if I place the music, I shouldn't have that phase problem anymore. So we'll just go ahead and go to one of my favorite songs here. And there's no more phase issue. The headphones work just as they intended, just as they are manufactured, perfectly reset.